Talking about being outside here, I mean, I took a look at just some of the temperatures hitting us this week. It's starting to creep up upper 80s there. Yeah, maybe we, in some we, 90s. Are, we are shifting gears, mm -hmm. and as a sign of that, I would be willing to bet you money. There are more than a few people watching us right now laying in bed nursing sunburns. Sunburns. Didn't yeah. get a lot yesterday, but today you made up for it. Got out on the lake today in the new boat. Yeah. Feels real good. Feels okay, good. we all got to go to work tomorrow. Another sign that the season is shifting is this. Nice evening out there, but guess what? We have a, a air quality alert in effect for tomorrow for Metro Louisville. Heart and respiratory problems uh, affected groups need to be aware of this. So there you have it. First one of the, uh, of the season, really. Uh, now that we're shifting gears into much hotter weather. I guess we use the word hot. A few showers tonight rumbling through uh, Franklin County, also through portions of Henry County. These are very light, will not amount to anything, and they're going to dissipate. Otherwise, skies will be partly cloudy or night. Now, let's go ahead and talk about what's going to be happening for the next couple of days, and that is some pop-up showers, hit and miss showers, you want to call them that, maybe a rumble of thunder. Let's put future cast into motion here. And you know, the 7, 7.30 tomorrow morning, not much going on. Partly sunny skies, we start the day out. We warm up by tomorrow afternoon, 81 degrees at 1.30, a few showers beginning to pop. Then we go through the heat of the day, and you see, we kind of call them, it looks like popcorn, really. Call them popcorn showers. And some areas can get a locally heavy downpour with these, but it's more mist than hit. Now we go through tomorrow night, they die out. Get into Wednesday, situation repeats itself again, and we'll do so on Thursday. For the next several days, just hit and miss showers, and mainly showers, uh, maybe a rumble of thunder occasionally. 20% on Tuesday. Percentages or the chances go up a little bit on Wednesday and Thursday, up to 40% in both cases there. Now, tonight it is a pleasant, really mild evening. It's uh, 78 degrees out at uh, the International Airport right now, 70 at Shepherdsville, 71 out at Lanesville, widen out a little bit. Looking uh, down to the south, uh, Bardstown, 70, same thing at uh, Springfield, 66 down at Campbellsville, one of the cooler places, 67 up at Bedford. Sky is partly cloudy. It is a nice evening around. Now, let's go ahead and walk you through the forecast see what we're going to have for the next several days. We'll call it partly cloudy overnight. In the city, the urban area is about 64 degrees. We can see some upper 50s when you get outside the city. Now, as we look forward to tomorrow, well, 86. That's what we've got today. No record, but it was certainly very warm out there. Warmed up rapidly on us. Mostly sunny skies tomorrow, so plenty of sunshine around tomorrow. 86 your high. Now, as we go through the rest of the week, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, there you see your shower chances. By Thursday, though, Isaiah, we're into the upper 80s, and right now we're forecasting 91 on Friday. It's always hot for the Crusade weekend. No way around it. Saturday, 90 degrees, 89 on Sunday. Hit belief, no effect on the Crusade, 88 by next Monday. Warmer weather on the way. We shift into summertime and Crusade mode very rapidly here at WHAS. Isaiah?